Hello all, this is Pavitra. Today I come up with averages topic. Now here, first I am going with the basics and after that I will solve the questions. Okay. Now, I have 10 chocolates and I am distributing to 5 children. How I can distribute? I can distribute une unevenly or I can distribute if I say equally, I can distribute 2, 2, 2, 2. Like this I can distribute. Correct. Here average is nothing but how many chocolates I have. Total I have 10 chocolates. Correct. Total I have 10 chocolates. I am distributing to 5 persons. Each children will get 2 chocolates. Now can I say average is nothing but sum of observations divided by number of observations. Number of observations. Correct. This is the average. Now what is the average? Average here that is 2. Similarly, if the question is asking like this, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, what is the average of these numbers? Here we can say middle number is the average, n is equals to 5, correct? If n is equals to 5, we can say middle number is the average. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Now what is the average of these numbers? Here also same, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. N is equals to 7. We can say middle number is the average. Similarly, if the question is asking like this, 122, 126, 130, and 134, 138, 142. Now, what is the average of these numbers? How we can calculate? Most of the people will calculate like this. Sum divided by number of observations. Okay, that will be fine. But what is the shortcut trick behind this? Here we can we can calculate first number plus last number divided by 2. 122 plus 142 divided by 2, it is giving the result as 264 divided by 2, it is giving the result as 132. 132 is the average. Or you can calculate middle two numbers divided by 2. It is giving the result as same, 132. Now when it is applicable, this is applicable only when the difference is same. When the difference is same, we can go with this approach. If the numbers are in arithmetic progression, we can follow this rule. Now, similarly, okay, moving forward to question number one. The average of first to 16 natural numbers. Now, what is the average of first to 16 natural numbers? First number plus last number divided by two. 1 plus 16 divided by 2, it is giving the result as 17 by 2. We can say 8.5. Answer is option B, 8.5. Moving forward to next. What is the average of first 20 even natural numbers? Even natural numbers. 2, 4, 6, 8. And what is the next? Uh, last number, we can expect 20 numbers. We can expect definitely... 40 is the last number. Here the person is asking average, correct? First number plus last number divided by 2, we can say 42 divided by 2, we can say 21. Answer is option B, 21. Moving forward to next. The average of first of five consecutive numbers is 45. And the largest number. Most of the people will calculate like this. X, X plus 1 and X plus 2 x plus 3 and x plus 4. After that, sum divided by number of observations. x plus, x plus 1, x plus 2, x plus 3 and x plus 4. Divided by total, how many numbers are there? 5 numbers are there. 5x plus 10 divided by 5 is equal to, what is the average here? 45. Now, 5x plus 10 is equal to 225. 5x is equal to 215. X is equal to 43. Now, what is the question? He is asking largest number. 43 plus 4, it is giving the result as 47. Answer is option A, 47. No need to calculate this method. Now, what is the shortcut trick behind this? Average of first of five consecutive numbers. Consecutive is nothing but side-by-side -side numbers. Average is 45, means middle number is 45. Now, what about next to two numbers, 46 and 47? And what about next to two numbers, like, uh, before two numbers, that is here 44 and here 43. Now, what is the question he is asking? Largest number he is asking, 47. 
आंसर इज ऑप्शन ये फोर्टी सेवन इफ यू कैलकुलेट एवरेज वॉट इज एवरेज ऑफ फोर्टी थ्री प्लस फोर्टी फोर प्लस फोर्टी फाइव वी कैन से दीज नंबर्स आर इन अर्थमेटिक प्रोग्रेशन साइड बाई साइड नंबर कंसिक्यूटिव नंबर्स करेक्ट वी कैन से मिडिल नंबर इज द एवरेज मूविंग फॉरवर्ड टू नेक्स्ट एवरेज ऑफ फोर इवन नंबर्स इज even numbers is 33 now what is the smallest number here also see processor uh, okay x plus 2 and here x plus 4 and x plus 6 and here this is x plus 8 these are the four even numbers what is the question he is asking smallest number he is asking okay x plus 2 x plus 4 x plus 6 x plus 8 divided by total how many numbers are there four and their average is 33 Four x plus twenty divided by four is equal to thirty three. Four x plus twenty is equal to one thirty two. Four x is equal to one one two. X is equal to twenty eight. What is the question? He is asking smallest number. Twenty eight plus two is equal to thirty. Answer is option A thirty. Instead of calculating like this, we can go with simple approach. Four numbers are there and their average is thirty three. Even numbers. The person is saying that even numbers. Now average is thirty three. Average is thirty three. Now can I say this number is thirty two and this number is thirty four and this number is thirty six? This is thirty. Correct. Yes. If you calculate first number plus last number divided by two or middle two numbers divided by two, definitely you will get thirty three. Thirty plus thirty six divided by two, sixty six divided by two. We can say thirty three. Ten seconds are enough for this question. What is the question he is asking? Smallest number thirty. Moving forward to next, this uh, this topic will helpful in DA also. Bank exams it will be most important topic averages. Moving forward to next question, question number five. What is the average of seventy four, seven sixty eight, seventy one, sixty seven, and seventy two? Most of the people will calculate like this. Seventy four plus sixty eight plus seventy one plus sixty seven plus seventy two divided by five. I am not suggesting that approach. Here, what you have to do is you have to consider one value. Let assume seventy. Now here for seventy, this is plus four is more. I am here minus two. I am here plus one. I am here minus three. I am here plus two. You can cancel out plus two and minus two. And what is this? Plus four uh, minus three. It is giving the result as one. One plus one, it is giving the result as two. Two by out of how many numbers are there? Five numbers are there. What is two by five? We can say zero point four. Now seventy plus zero point four, it is giving the result as seventy point four. Answer is option B, seventy point four. Now here the homework question that is thirty four. Twenty-nine, forty-two, thirty-five, twenty-two, and thirty. To solve, I comment your answer in the comment box. By using this approach only, uh, you people will write. Okay. By assuming the number, and uh, we are taking the difference. That's it. Going forward to next. Average of twenty students is forty-five. What will be the average weight of teacher? Eighty-seven kgs are included. Most of the people will calculate like this. This is the traditional approach. Twenty numbers are or uh, twenty students are there, and their average is forty-five. Average is forty-five. Total, how many students are there? Twenty students are there. Now, what about some of their weights? Some of their weights is equals to forty-five into twenty. It is giving the result as nine hundred. Now, when teacher is included, eighty-seven kgs. Nine hundred plus eighty-seven. It is giving the result as nine eighty-seven. Now, what is the question he is asking? What is the average weight divided by total? How many? Twenty-one, uh, including two teacher. We can say twenty-one members are there. Nine eighty-seven divided by twenty-one. We can say forty-seven kgs. Answer is option C, forty-seven kgs. Instead of calculating like this, we can go with the shortcut trick. Now, what is the shortcut trick here? Twenty students are there. Their average is forty-five. Average is forty-five. Twenty students. Average is forty-five. 
when 87 cases are included, the average becomes, uh, what is the average? The question is asking. Now, how much is increase, increased? 42 cases are increased. Due to this person, means teacher is joining, that is the reason average is increasing. Correct. Means average is increased to how many cases? 42 cases. 42 divided by total, how many, uh, how many persons are there? 21 persons are there. And here the average is, we can say 2. Now, what is 42 plus 2? It is giving the result as 47. Answer is option C, 47. Uh, sorry, what is 45? 45 plus 2, 47. 45 plus 2, 47. Moving forward to the next. The average weight of 25 students in a group is 15 years. Teacher is included, the average is increases by one. How many students are there? Initially, 25 students are there. And their average is 15 years. Now, what about some of their ages? 375. When teacher is included, 26. The average is increased by one. 16 plus 1 and here plus 1. 26 into 16, it is giving the result as 416. Now, what is the question? He is asking teacher age in years. Now, what is the age of teacher? 41 years. 416 minus 375, it is giving the result as 41. Answer is 41, option B. Now, what is the shortcut trick behind this? 25 students are there and their average is 15 years. When teacher is included, the average uh, averages increases by 1. Average is increases by 1. Now, what is 26 into 1? It is giving the result as 26. Initially, 15. 26 plus 15, it is giving the result as 41. Answer is option A, 41 years. Moving forward to the next question. The average of 20 numbers is 22. If one number is excluded, the average becomes 20. Find the excluded number. 20 numbers is 22. What about some of the numbers? We can say 440. One number is excluded, 90. The average becomes 20. 90 into 20, 380. Now, what is the excluded number? 60 is the excluded number. Now, instead of calculating like this, 20 numbers is 22. And if one number is excluded, we can say 90. The average becomes 20. Average becomes 20 means 22 becomes 20. We can say decrement of 2. What is 19 into 2? It is giving the result as 38. Now, what is the initial average here? 22. 38 plus 22. It is giving the result as 60. Answer is option C, 60. Yes. If you people are not getting this trick, simple way, I'm telling you, okay? The average of 20 numbers is 22. Let us assume 20 numbers. Let us assume the number is 22, okay? The number is 22. Now, how many numbers are there like this? 20 numbers are there. Now, let us assume this is the 20th number, okay? 22 number, 20 numbers. This is the 20th number. Now, 20th number I am removing, okay? I am excluding the 20th number. Means here 22 is excluded. The average becomes 20. Average becomes 20 means every everyone is giving how much? 2, 2, 2, like that. Now, how many numbers we are taking? From uh, how many numbers we are taking? 90 numbers we are taking. 19 into 2, it is giving the result as 38. Now, these 38, I have to add it to this, uh, this number. Correct, 20th number, I have to add. Now, 38 plus 22, it is giving the result as 60. Answer is option C, 60. Moving forward to the next question. The average score of 30 students is 245. Let us assume all the numbers are 245. Yes, definitely we can say you will get the average is uh, 245 only. If you consider as total 30 numbers is 245. Now, topper's uh, topper is excluded. Now, this person is excluded. Okay, let us assume this person is topper. 
and the average becomes 241. Means everyone, I'm taking how many marks? Three marks. Out of how many people are there? Total, 29 people are there. This person is excluding, correct? Now, three into 29. Uh, how many marks? Four into 29. Four into 29, it is giving the result as 116. Now, this person is excluding. 245 plus 116, it is giving the result as 361. Answer is option B, 361. I hope it is clear. Moving forward to the next. The average marks obtained by six students is 35. Each student is got 35, 35, and here 35. Six students, 35. If topper is excluded, this person is excluded. Let us assume this person is topper. Average of remaining five students is decreased to 31. Decreased to 31 means everyone is giving how many? Four, four marks the persons are giving. Four into five, it is giving the result as 20 marks are given. Now these 20 marks will add to left of the, means leaving the person because the person is topper. Means the person got full marks. That is the reason uh, average is becomes 35. Correct. Now here I have to add these 20 to top of person. 35 plus 20. It is giving the result as what? 55. Answer is option C, 55. Yes. Thank you. I hope it will be helpful for you. Please do share and please do subscribe my channel. Thank you.